Hey, Bola Buddies, thanks for watching. All right, I have a featured seller video for you guys, and this guy is in my Facebook group, and he scored big with some storage units. And it's not like the typical storage units where you go to an auction and you bid. So what he did is he had a guy order a poster off of him, one of his posters that he makes, and I'm gonna share that with you guys soon. And they got to talking about reselling and the guy mentioned that his parents had a storage unit that um, they wanted to sell. So he went and looked at it and made him an offer and he ended up buying it for $400 and he got approximately 2,000 items, making it about 20 cents an item. Oh my goodness, how cool is that? And then the other unit, he put a ad on Facebook Marketplace looking for vintage and Halloween or Christmas items. And it was in Palm Springs. And he paid $1,000 for approximately three to 4,000 items. Wow. So... Let's just say he has less than 50 cents in most of the items I'm going to show you. There are a few that came from, well, most of the items came from that. I think there's one that came from a thrift store, but it's pretty amazing. So I'm going to post um, a link to his store because he sells plants and flowers and um, posters that he makes and that he, oh, I forget what the word is. Let's see, plants from his yard. He grows them and then propagates them and then sells them year round. Huh. And wait until you see how much money he's making doing this. It's amazing. And the posters are super awesome also. So we're gonna get started here, but there are, I mean, those are just a small part of his store, but those are things that he sells over and over and over and over again and is constantly making money. So if you can find something like that to sell in your store that you can either make or like he does the flowers, something that is coming. I mean, he's growing it in his yard and he's selling it over and over and over again. He's making a lot of money. So it's, <clears throat> excuse me, a super fantastic idea. So. We're going to check out the other bolos that he got. He got. We're going to check out the ones he got from the storage units. <laughs> All right. We're going to get started here. All right. The first item. Uh, let me get this on screen share. All right. The first item is this uh, Pioneer. Is it a CD? CD player? Yeah. With a microphone and a remote. And it's all kinds of fancy. But he got this out of the storage buyout. So he had about 20 cents in it. <laughs> How amazing is that? And it sold for full asking price of $118.96. And the buyer paid the shipping. Very cool. This one also came from a um, one of the storage units. So again, 20 cents. <laughs> And it sold for $106. And I just love this picture, how he's got it like attached. So it looks like the guy's sitting. How cool is that? These are great photos. Great photos. Very cool. The next item are these ornaments. And they are shatterproof. Very, very pretty and very cool. Again, these came out of the storage unit. They sold for $29.71 and the buyer paid shipping. And his store name is T Prince 4C. I think that's his actual store name also. Let me double check. Yep, there's the puppy dog. Here are the prints I was telling you about, but we'll get to those. Okay, so here is one of the plants that he sells. So he's selling this for $17.95 plus shipping, okay? And I'm sure he's sold more than three. He probably just relists. But this is what, he's got these beautiful pictures and he shows you exactly what he's sending and what you're gonna get. How cool is that? Is that cool or what? So anyway, what a great way to make money, right? 
I wish I knew how to do something like that, but I don't like to garden or plant flowers or anything like that. But I, it, he shows me that there is definitely money that can be made. The next item again came out of one of the storage units. So this is a Kurt S. Adler Santa's World Christmas lights. And again, they're ornament ornaments. And these sold for $31.88 plus shipping. The next item is more flowers. Now, look at this picture. Magenta pink ground cover, succulent flower ice plant. You get 20 healthy cuttings. And you buy one for $15.26 or two for $14.50 each. And he sold $118. Guys, do those numbers, 118. So let's say 1450. Sorry, I got to get out my calculator. I'm just not that smart. So $14.50. Oops, 1450 times 118. $1,711. And that is amazing. And his pictures are great. I'm sure those are definitely, definitely helping him to sell the product, but very, very cool and a fantastic idea. Oh, and if you want to buy some down in the description of the video, I will have a link to his store. So if you see anything that he makes, like the prints that I'm going to show you or the flowers, you can definitely go purchase from him. I'm sure he would very much appreciate it. Here are the targets that he makes. So for this one, you get 100 targets. And I think he said the targets end up costing costing him about six cents each. So, um, and and these are really cool targets. So let's see, hundred times six cents would that be six dollars? <laughs> Let me check because it's been a while since I've been in school. Yes, six dollars. I was going to be embarrassed if I was wrong. Okay, so six bucks, and he's selling them for forty-four dollars and ninety-five cents. Again, he sold a hundred and one of these, so a hundred and one times forty-four ninety-five. He's made four thousand five hundred and thirty-nine dollars on this listing. How cool is that? And I know he has like sets of twenty. He has smaller sets available. So if you're interested in getting some targets definitely go check it out in the description. There is a link. The next item are these Christmas ornaments. Again, we're from the storage locker. So I don't know if these would have been like 20 some cents each, or if this was 20 some cents for all of them, but either way, he sold this for $46 and 71 cents with uh, the buyer paying shipping. Vintage uh, porcelain train station and train figures. This one sold for $50 and 96 cents and the buyer paid shipping. Vintage Disney Mickey and Minnie figure. This is, um, I think it's just like a little figurine type deal sold for $34.95. It looks like he had two of them. So again, he picked this up for less than 50 cents in one of the storage units and he has sold two of them. These are the mini ornaments. He got these at a thrift store for $1. I think he underpriced them. He said they sold like really fast. I want to say it was within 24 hours, but they're just little wood vintage um, um, ornaments. So super cute, but sold for $14.95 plus shipping. Another snowsuit sold for $149.99. Great pictures. I love I love the pictures where it looks like they're sitting. I just think it's great. Um, it really captures your eye. So very cool. So 20 cents, I think he said he had in that. It's amazing. Here's another one. These are stocking holders. He sold two of them for $49.95. These were a part of the storage buyout. So I think he thought he had about 33 cents each in those. Salt and pepper shaker. And I think these came from a storage unit also. Sold for $24.95. Here's another one of his flowers. This 
one sells for $17.95. And this is, I think this is what he actually sends you. And then this is just pictures of, um, I guess, how they look or what he's produced from them. I'm not really sure. I don't understand plants, but I'm sure that you guys would understand more. Let's see what his description says. So yeah, he's got a really nice uh, detailed description. If I can grow these, anyone can. <laughs> I was given three cuttings as seen in my second picture. All of my pictures show just how well this beautiful cactus has grown and propagated. Very cool. So again, he sells more than just one type of flower. I just think it's so cool. Another, um, this is an Ornamotion rotating ornament. He sold 23 of these, you guys, for $17.95 each. Super, super cool. And um, I don't know if it's actually the ornament or if it's just the thing that holds the ornament. It turns and so it's just the, it's like the motor, I guess, maybe. Huh. See? Very cool. So $17.95, sold 23 of them. That is awesome. This is just a vintage, or I'm sorry, not even vintage. It's a 3D felt Christmas stocking. $19.95 it sold for. The next item. And again, these came from the storage unit. He sold four of these. This is a Tasmanian Devil uh, Looney Tunes Christmas ornament. Sold for $19.95 plus shipping. It's awesome. Another one of his flowers. $17.95 for this one plus shipping. He sold 56. You can see. How cool is that? Does anybody else think this is super cool like I do? I think it's so cool. It's just making money, 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 money. The next item, and I really think he did an excellent job with his photos on um, the vintage Halloween, not vintage, on the Halloween items. I don't think they're vintage. But this is the Creepy Hollow 1996. Well, 1996 is kind of vintage, but I don't know. 96. Yeah, it's vintage. Very cool. But this sold for $49.95 plus shipping. And I think what he said is that each little figure, so this was like 33 cents, 33 cents, 33 cents, is how he figured out like the total that he had in the, in all the items. So you can see each one is pictured separately. So still not much, less than $5. The next item is this village, four lighted houses, 19 piece set, sold for $54.95. He had two of them and the buyer paid shipping. These Christmas ornaments, Thomas Piconi 2004, these sold for $23.76 and they are super adorable. I would have to say, I think they're super cute and the buyer paid shipping. The next item is another Thomas Piconi. Uh, this is a village. This sold for $139.95. Very cool. And these all came out of these storage units, you guys. So he really made out on these units. The next item are these elephant bush. 20 elephant bush succulent red stem. No clue what that word is. Um, yeah, so this is what that he sends you. How on earth does he ship these? I need to ask him that. Like, I wonder if you have to like wrap them and keep them like moist or do you put them in a bag or a box? It's beautiful. But, um, he's selling these, you can see for $13.56 each or $12.88 or $12.20 if you buy three. So very, very cool. The next item is this Black Widow Spider Gold Web Ornament. And he has multiples. He sold six at $13.56 plus shipping. Kurt S. Adler 
hand-blown gold glass ornaments. Sold two of them for $19.95 plus shipping. And this is a goofy fabric mache figure. He sold two of them for $49.95 plus shipping. This is the same thing, only it's Donald Duck, sold for $49.95 plus shipping. Now, this is one of them that he um, prints off himself. So it's not a huge priced item, but he just prints them off, you know? How to raise or how to rise above the holiday madness. Red Bull gives you wings. And I I'm not sure how printing things off works, but he sold five of these for six dollars and seventy six cents plus shipping. This Rudolph the Red Nose Reindeer Plush sold for twenty four ninety five plus shipping. And that was a hallmark. This Star Wars trilogy. Um, I don't know. Is it a book? Yeah, it looks like it's a book. They're books. Sold for $84.96 plus shipping. And that was out of the, the storage unit. So he had about 20 cents in this. And then this one, oops, this one, he took a best offer of $90. And this came out of the storage unit also. And the buyer paid shipping. So this is a 1997 McMemories. You deserve a break today. McDonald's restaurant ceramic village. How funny is that? Pretty cool, huh? $90, 90 buckaroos plus shipping. And then visit store. And I didn't show you guys. Here's another one that he has. This poster is super cute. Obey mom. Cause even when she's wrong, she's right. <laughs> And he sold 34 of them at $6.38 and the buyer pays shipping. So that's another one that he has a lot of. So I'm going to go to see other items. And I always like to search highest first. And he doesn't have anything. I mean, $54.95 is his highest priced item. But he's got the shipping's kind of high. And I is he in California? That's probably why. If you, yeah, he's in California. So whenever somebody's in California and they have shipping, it's always high to where I'm at. So I'm guessing that's based on my location. But you can see he has tons and tons and tons of awesome Halloween and Christmas items. Here's Targets. So very, very cool. All right, you guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe if you have not already. And then like, comment, and share. Nope, oh, he's got more flowers here. I didn't even get all of them. Look at this. Amazing. Super cool. Um, I just showed you guys some of them. I thought I showed most of them, but I did not. So definitely go check out his store. The link's down in the description. I'm also on Twitter and Instagram, and I just recently started Pinterest. So you can check me out there also. Links are down below in the description. As always, thanks for watching. And I'm going to come back over here and tell you to have a great night. Thanks, you guys.